so we finally have something amazing something extraordinary after a long long time and in this case i am talking about rising os and another version is released which is version 4.1 it's been only few days when the last version which was version 4.0 was released but now we have version 4.1 rising os i've installed it on my device which is poco f5 this is the official version and the changes are just so amazing so make sure to watch this video till the end you are definitely going to love this update because with this new update we have some amazing changes so stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end let's find out some of the things which are included with this rising os latest version first change which you will find after installing this is the desktop mode option is now available there and in case you don't know this desktop mode option was already there in one custom home where this is originally from and that is libre mobile os which is lmo droid but in this case we also have the option for desktop mode on tv so we have two options available in case you want to use the desktop mode you can use it and yes of course some things might be device specific some things might not work as expectedly in your case but that's just device specific another thing is which is one of the main highlights of this custom room with this new update is the quick settings panel we finally have something new something amazing as you can see in top left we have some options for example some shortcuts there these are considered as widgets and also in the top right we have brightness slider we have volume slider and yes these things are just so amazing and by the way you can use them with android 14 style quick settings panel what i'm using right now android 14 style quick setting panel tiles but you can also theme it you can also change it to the android 11 style and how you can do that simply move on to the quick settings customizations here you will find some options like quick settings style styles and quick settings panel styles so for example if i choose style styles to circle ones right if i move on to other options here you will see you it will be like it will be themed like this now we have to adjust the columns and rows so for example in this case i'm gonna choose five columns as you can see like this one and let's just change the quick quick settings rows to two to one sorry this uh, two was the default one so as you can see this is now what we have android 11 style quick settings panel is already applied including that this widgets and yes definitely it's looking just so amazing quite worthy to check it out and yes this is one of the main highlights of this custom room this new update by the way this new update also brings you some new wallpapers which were kind of expected move on to the wallpaper section you will find cmf by nothing wallpapers by the way in case you don't know these wallpapers are also present in some of the other apps for example as far as i know these things are present in pix wallpapers wallpaper app if you want to explore you can get them and these things are actually pre-installed included with this rising os custom room some of the other wallpapers are just so amazing like rising os 2.0 has some great wallpapers which are one of which are actually some of my favorite ones nothing os 2.0 and a lot more extra wallpapers also it brings you ai wallpaper support so that's good these are some visual changes some major noticeable changes with the version 4.1 but in case you don't know the rising os, rising OS version 4.0 brings you some changes with the lock screen clock styles too like usually in some of the custom rooms you only have some clock custom clocks right but in this case even after applying some custom clocks you can change the fonts of that custom clock so that is looking actually quite unique because not every custom room is giving you these kind of features that's just so amazing so yes we are finally getting some changes with some custom rooms which is a very good thing like some of the custom rooms are still giving you similar kind of things but in some of the custom rooms only a few of the custom rooms we are actually getting some changes some actual unique things as you can see the lock screen with the ios clock and ios widgets definitely looks good but including that if you choose to if you want to choose the depth wallpapers that option is also present here but it also brings you nothing OS style widgets on your lock screen that makes your lock screen look quite better including all those things these are the things which you have by default for example some miscellaneous options and by the way one thing let me tell you again that it also brings you custom launchers i mean two launchers are included you can switch between them in my case i'm using quick step launcher which is also considered as autos launcher but it also brings you the support for pixel launcher in case you want to by default pixel launcher is here but you can also use this custom launcher named as autos launcher if you need more customizations more freedom to customize 
customize your home screen so these are the things these were the things i just wanted to let you know thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one until then take care